discuss downy mildew blight. This is a viburnum suspensum hedge. Um, and as you can see, there are some brown areas on this hedge. Um, this is downy mildew blight. Uh, it starts off as a spot and then it enlarges and, and shrinks everything up, shrivels it up, and eventually will cause leaf drop. And then if you come over here, where this overhead irrigation is taking place, you have this head right here, spraying over the top of the plant material, and it has defoliated much of it. And I have a leaf in my hand, I'm not sure how well we'll be able to zoom in on it, but you see that white, velvety stuff, that is the reproductive structures with the spores. So that is the downy mildew reproductive structure. Um, a good idea is always to keep the overhead irrigation off of the plant material, keep it as dry as possible. Downy mildew is a water mold, so this will require water mold specific fungicides for, for good control. But uh, fixing those cultural conditions is gonna be important as well. Get the water off the overhead irrigation, off the plant if possible, and then cleaning up underneath all this leaf drop material that has caused, um, you know, it has it's it's harbors the the spores, so that's still there. Uh, so if we can get the, the the leaves underneath out, that would be great. Um, go a long way into to controlling this disease. Um, so anyway, that is downy mildew blight on viburnum suspensum.